Hi, I'm Peter Solomon. I am the principal horn of the Shanghai Symphony Orchestra and horn faculty at Shanghai Orchestra Academy. And I'm proud to endorse Ultimate Brass. Uh, I came to Ultimate Brass a few years ago um, after being introduced by some friends. And at first I was like, okay, there's some new mouthpieces to try, sure. And then I tried them and went, wow, these are really fantastic. Um, so I worked with Sun to develop my own line. And now I have a custom mouthpiece that I really love. And uh, every time I try something else, I always return back to this one because it's really how I feel I sound the best. Uh, and coming to Beijing is really, really great to know that I can get excellent work done on my instrument. Uh, I'm in Beijing now after just having a tune-up on my horn and it's playing really, really nice. So I'm really proud to endorse Ultimate Brass and I hope that you can find the time to try the mouthpieces or if you're ever in Beijing to come to the shop, I think you'll really enjoy it. So some general horn playing tips, uh, it really is all about the air. I've noticed in China, actually in Asia, because I used to work in Korea as well, that many teachers focus exclusively on the embouchure. And while embouchure can be important, I would put it as the number four or number five thing that you should think about. So when working uh, with a teacher, when working to improve yourself, it's really important to focus on your air, your airflow, uh, and also your body, your body tension, making sure that the air is not getting blocked. And in addition, I think a really effective way to improve is just to listen, listen, listen to as many great recordings as you can and listen carefully, really pick out the details over time your subconscious will start to improve even on its own and then your playing level will start to rise and then you'll hear more things more things that you want to fix so it may even feel like you even have further to go but that's because you're developing your inner ear and you're developing your inner musicianship so my advice for brass playing and horn playing is really just two simple things air and listen